This is a video by Richpin. Today we're working on a Toyota Tercel. Today we're replacing the bump stop and shields on the front struts. First thing you want to do is jack up the car, secure it on jack stands, and remove the tire and wheel assemblies. Next we need to remove this bracket that holds the brake hose to the strut. It is a 14 millimeter head bolt. Next we need to remove the two strut to knuckle bolts. They're 19 millimeter on both ends. We need to remove those now. There's the top one. And there's the bottom one. Now you can remove the bolts. and then free the strut. I'm using a soft hammer here on the strut so I'm not damaging it. Now that's all free. Next we have to remove the three strut to body nuts. There are three 12 millimeter head nuts. Now, when you get the last one, reach underneath, support the strut. And there it is. Okay, now we have to compress the spring. Okay, now the spring has no tension on the seat. Now we can remove the center strut nut. Now we can remove the top baron. Uh, this top seat looks a little rusted, so we're going to spray a little penetrating oil right here. And tap the seat. There it is. Now we can remove our spring. Now we can remove the old bump stop here. what's left of the shield here. Okay, now we can put our new bump stop and shield in place. Make sure it's 
below the flat on the shaft right there. And we can put our coil spring back in place. Now, the top seat has a flat in there. It can only go one way. So make sure you put it on there, turn it, and engage the flat. There it is. Flat's all in place. Put our top baron back on. Now we want to put our center shaft nut in place. down. Okay, now we gotta make sure our spring is seated correctly before we Compressor here. And that's it. The bump stop and shield is all in place, and now it's just a matter of replacing the strut back in the car, and you've just replaced a bump stop and shield on your Toyota Tercel.